Today on the Wax Pack Flashback, we're continuing on with TRN's Haunted Halloween, and we're opening a pack of the Phantom cards. Check it out. The Phantom. Uh, again, like uh, the Little Shop of Horrors and the Skeleton Warriors, not fully full-on Halloween-ish. It's got the cool Halloween name, The Phantom. This was based on the movie. I think these are from 95, uh, 96. So The Phantom was a very popular comic strip character going way, way, way back. You see here, 1996 King Features Syndicate, part of the King Features stuff. Um, uh, what, is he the one that said, uh, who knows what evil lurks in the hearts of men, The Phantom knows? Or no, that was The Shadow. That was, never mind, never mind. So we've got some uh, some Inkworks guarantees here. This is from Inkworks. At least one complete set, numbers one through 90 of collector cards can be found in each sealed display box. So if you bought a whole box, you're gonna get a whole set. That's cool. All cards, including any randomly packed bonus card will be found defect free or we will replace. That's very nice of them. And the big trading card boom of the 90s is good to have a company with some morals. Odds of finding the Phantom Foil and Bose card puzzle cards, 1 in 10. Foil work skulls, 1 in 35. Disappearing Phantom Lenticular works, 1 in 96. Hmm. So they do have chase cards in these packs. They do not appear to be very plentiful, though. I'd say our odds are against finding any of those. So the Phantom featured the skull. I've actually got a Phantom ring. I wish I'd have brought it over here. I got a Phantom ring. Well, that ring, actually. I've got one of those. Very cool. Heavy. I remember seeing the movie. Uh, I think I went to the theater to watch it. The man who cannot die wears two rings. On his right hand is the sacred skull ring. And when he punches lawbreakers in the jaw, it leaves an impression of the skull in their flesh. The other ring is the mark of the phantom's justice and his crossed swords. He uses this ring to press into the wrist of those who are his compatriots. This marks them as allies of the phantom. This symbol is also the sign of the jungle patrol. Hmm. There's two rings. Well, I've got the skull ring. Down here, horrifying night. On board the merchant sailing ship is a captain's young son. He watches helplessly as his father fights in vain for his life. Swords clash in the rampage on the wooden decks. Sailors and the boys, seamen, friends fall one by one to the pirates. These cards are well made. Got a very nice sheen on them. Look at that. You can see it really well there. I love comic book based movies. And, you know, this comic strip character was based on a, there's a movie based on comics. But I don't know how well it's fitting our haunted Halloween month thing here. But the name's cool. And he is a bit of a mysterious. I'm going to have to go back and watch this movie again. I really don't remember it. I know I went to the theater to see it. I just don't remember a whole lot about it. So I'll be going going back to check this movie out again. Ooh. I'm going to have her MVP. Ooh, I don't know. Two good looking cards featuring the Phantom. I don't know which one to make my MVP. Walking Phantom is chased uptown and in the Central Park where he takes refuge in the Park Zoo. Man, I don't know. I think I'm going to go with the one with the skull. That's going to be our MVP of this pack. Hey, thanks for watching this episode of the Wax Pack Flashback brought to you by the Retro Network and also brought to you by Trading Card Database, tcdb.com. It is a trading card lover's heaven. Cards from through the years and packs, probably most cards and packs from all through the years are featured there and you can sign up for a free account and jump into the discussion and search out old cards and just relive all kinds of fun old memories. If you like this video, be sure to hit the like button down there. And uh, if you really liked it, be sure to subscribe to the TRN YouTube channel where you find the Wax Pack Flashback and other series like Jay Plays. And you get access to our uh, playlist that you can dive into if you're a retro lover and find all kinds of cool stuff. Uh, also hit the little notification bell down there so you know when we drop a new video. You will not be sorry. 
Hey, so also stop by the RetroNetwork.com. It's the central hub for all things Retro Network. Uh, the written features, you can find access to all of our podcasts and other stuff we do, the game show podcast and the like. Uh, drop us a comment uh, if you like this pack of cards, if you didn't like this pack of cards, what you liked about this pack of cards, what kind of cards you want to see us open in the future. And uh, again, I'm Mickey, and I'll see you next time.